Some South Florida kindergartners will soon have money in the bank thanks to a great new program. Studies show that students with a small savings account are more likely to enroll and graduate from college. This is Florida's way to bank on their students' future. This is the right idea at the right time for absolutely the right students. The city of Miami is investing in the future, and the future is kids. So many individuals actually believing that empowering kindergartner students with a savings account to build revenues towards a college tuition uh, could be possible, and that's exactly what we've launched. Starting December 6, kindergartners from 30 public elementary schools throughout Miami will be given their own free savings account. Miami-Dade County Public Schools partnered with several nonprofit groups to launch Future Bound Miami. The goal is to get kids ready for college. Uh, I just think that it's a perfect opportunity for me to plan for my child and to also try to teach her some financial responsibility. $25 or $50 funds will already be dispersed to students depending on their financial need. If we make a small investment in children, that that investment will pay off in terms that we could never imagine. And this is just the beginning. Over the next couple of years, we'll grow to the entire county touching all zip codes. Research shows that students with even small savings accounts are three times more likely to enroll in college and four times more likely to graduate. And this is just the first step in helping them get there. So the kids are smiling, the conversation is happening, and that's what's important. It's really the conversation that ensues. It's not necessarily the investment, but the conversation that ensues and the mindset that takes place about their future. Talking about college and kindergarten, love it. Parents of those eligible kids will have a month to activate the free accounts. There are no fees, no minimum deposits, and those students will not be able to access that funding until they're 18. At the news desk, Lynn Martinez, 7 News.